Hello again, Juro Sen, and we're talking about backup today. This is the Drobo 5D, and it has a number of hard drives in it, and if one fails, it will not lose your information. So it's probably wise to look at one of these types of devices. There are many kinds out there that will do the same thing. Well, mine is running dangerously low in terms of hard drive space, so I'm gonna replace one of the hard drives with this and we're having a close look at it now. It is the six terabyte Western Digital. Now this is the red series. And the reason I'm using one of these Western Digital red drives is that it's hardened for the use in one of these devices. You might find them in servers as well. They're very, very good and reliable hard drives. So look for the red ones if you're using Western Digital, for example. So let's go ahead and try it out. So the first thing you have to do with the Drobo is remove this plate just magnetically attaches like that and you see one two three four five drives and the red light means this drive is almost chockers that's full in Australian language so what we have to do is take it out and it's pretty easy all you have to do is find the button on the left hand side push that lever in and pop out the drive that is nearly full and that three terabyte drive is one of the smaller ones in that array and it's pretty easy just next to the red light uh, give it a bit of a blow it's uh, will build up some dust over time put in the new drive it's a matter of just slapping it in away you go and in a couple of seconds the drive will be formatted for the system on the Drobo 5D and after that the drive will flash there you go a couple of colors to show you that it's rebuilding that drive into one big stack. And before I finish it off, have a look at these blue lights here. They indicate how much data is on your system. You can see that I've got a fair bit of information on there, but it was a hell of a lot worse before I replaced that drive with a six terabyte drive. So you place this onto the front of the Drobo 5D to finish the job. Not quite complete though. That will stop flashing from green to yellow or amber when the drive is completely settled. That is all the data is distributed evenly. So when one drive fails in the future, don't pull it out now, it would be bad. But in the future, when it's all green, that means that your data will be safe. You can set it for two simultaneous drive failures. That is extremely rare. I can guarantee your drives will fail, but it's rare to have two in the same system fail at the same time. If that happens, then you can pull two out put two more back in. Remember, you have to have the same size disk going in when that happens or get a larger drive. Probably take the opportunity to upgrade with greater capacity. So that's it. That's the Drobo 5D, an absolute must if you're into professional photography or video. There are other systems out there, but I really love the Drobo 5D in particular. They really have some big stuff available for the pro end as well. In future shows, we'll look at the cloud as a backup option as well because this might be overkill for you if you don't have terabytes and terabytes of video and photographic data. But one thing you should do is make sure you have a backup solution because your hard drives will die at some stage and who knows, you might have your gear stolen. So make sure you have a system. But until the next time we meet, this has been another review for 7news.com.au.